I want you to think about something. To be mindful, which we practiced all year, is to be aware of what is happening right now. An affirmation is a short phrase or statement about yourself. We have to know where our kids are in order to take them where we need them to go. I think we do a really good job of monitoring the data and trying to connect all the pieces, find the holes in their learning, and then move them on as fast as we can. We make sure our kids know what their MAP test goal should be, because we want them to have that sense of responsibility. We're trying to have our kids shift their mindset from, you gave me a grade, to I'm earning a grade, and that I, ha I play a part in my own success. How many of you came in first grade? We sit down and talk about, okay, this is where you were, this is where we think that you need to be. And I talk to them about it. What do you think your goal should be? And we reach an agreement in that way. In fall, I got a 204 on math. And I was supposed to go up, in spring, I was supposed to go up nine points. I so made my goal and I got the 213. Think of an emotion. I think it's important for them to see where they were or where they are and how far they have come. And I think setting goals with them lets them know, okay, I can do this. When I beat my goal, I was excited and proud of myself for beating it. I believed in myself and didn't give up. It's a good type of goal because it's more helpful that you know where you are so you don't have to be wary. And you can just know, I got to get keep up with this work so I can meet that goal. You've got the big okay. test, but then during the day, you've got little things, the daily things that add up. What you're doing every day to achieve that. It helps you know what you need to improve on and do a little better. And it helps the teacher and you to understand if you're doing okay. What's that main point of view? We really want to get our students to have that Pardon? intrinsic motivation to be great. And then once we can do that, once we can flip that switch, then sky's the limit for them. Even if somebody says you can't do it, you're not able to, you're too small or something, you won't give up just because people say that. You, you go through it just to get to where you want it to be. The higher grades you get, the more challenging it is. But hey, it's a future, not the past. You got to get ready. You can't walk away from it.